We got Lispresso in the house. What up, my G? Go Lysha. Go Lysha. Lispresso. Lispresso. You're about to watch Johnny and I experience the Somnium space together and us hanging out using Oculus Quest 2 headset. So we're going to be in the headsets together and you'll see the recorded footage from there. And you're going to see four things. First, joining a meetup and the dance party that they're hosting inside the Somnium space. And second, walking through the Purse of Land and troubleshooting some of the UX problems that I experienced and that Johnny helped me troubleshoot. And third, navigating around the metaverse space using a racing car, which is the first time experience for me. And lastly, uh, showing how organizations are utilizing the metaverse space within the Somnium space. Let's dive in. Thank you everybody for coming through and hanging out. Like I said, don't forget to introduce yourself to all the neighbors and new faces you see. This is a big old family and it's a new way of doing things. But we're all a bunch of creators. Let's just have fun and connect. Let us ride and huzzah. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna take you to this place over here. Let's go to the teleportation system right over here. You're gonna hit start and you're gonna look at the map. You're gonna zoom out of the map and you're gonna go to the very, very top right. Okay, let's go there. I wish you would like highlight the name somehow. So it's not by the lake. Yeah. It's it's above the lake, between the, between the lake and the track. There's one to the top left, that one. Okay, then go on the bottom and say, take me there. And then, how do I? How we feeling, Take me there. Uh, you see that? I don't see that take me there. How we feeling? Don't you see don't see me take me there? there. Yeah. Let us we might have to walk the there then, because you may not have teleportation yet. It is something oh, there that... You go. Cool. Okay. Oh, there you go. Hey. Oh, there hey, you we go. made it. Okay. Perfect. Oh. So people own these lands and they're empty. Some of these are empty. So like if you come over here, I won't get inside the square. Let's get out of this square here. But it says 2926, for example. Somebody owns that. You can click on it. Or I guess you can't click on it. But somebody owns that and they don't have anything on it yet. Some over here has already built a foundation. But there's actually a bunch of buildings. This is an endless world. Like we could have walked here. But that teleportation device, somebody paid for it. Probably a lot of money to get it in that particular area. Got it. So we're going to go over to this track so we can try some cars and get around faster, okay? Oh man, I get so confused by teleportation. What are the things you're talking about? I don't even know what you're talking about. What are the arrows? I don't see arrows. So so when you hold, right, the stick? Yeah. And then if you... You can actually see the arrow, three arrows, like... Oh, because you don't have the settings set up yet. It's like the Somnium menu. It says, welcome, oh. try Johnny. Oh. That's why. Okay, so you're going there. This is where you can change your avatar. So you're going to do a bunch of cool stuff. But anyway, you're going to go to settings there. And you're going to scroll all the way down. You like click on the scroll wheel on the right. And drag all the way down. Uh -huh. And then you'll see like it says tablet. Uh -huh. And you're going to go above that. Is motion. Uh -huh. And you're going to be on enable strafing on. Locomotion type head. And direction on teleport off. Okay, I was so confused because there's like multiple menus. Like one in the song. Yeah, you're, you're, you're in the stream VR. Yeah, Got you're it. in the stream VR settings, I think. Got it. Okay. Okay, so that's, now let's go. So it should just teleport and keep you in the same direction now. Yeah. Cool. What's still weird is like, I see red. Oh, because you only tele let you teleport once in a couple of seconds. Okay. I think it's something like that. I think it, so. I run and I teleport. Yeah, and it says red. I keep holding it until it yeah. turns green. Yeah. Oh, because it usually it means like you can't teleport there. That's why I keep getting confused with the UI. Uh, I don't. Oh see yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We're good. Keep going. This, yeah, we're gonna keep going. See. It's they're all parked somewhere really far away. So we're just trying to get to them. It's a little sneaky way to get to a car, because these aren't cars we own. Somebody else actually paid for these cars. Oh. Okay, we're gonna carjack. We're not gonna like carjack, but we're gonna borrow it temporarily. <laughs> we're almost there. So this is where people race. No, this is like no, a parking no, lot where people race. Where? Like this is all open world and things, events are happening here sometimes where they do races and they win NFTs, they win money. All right, we're almost there. 
Is this normal that there are not many people? Oh yeah, I mean this isn't this is like uh we were at the event. I think everyone that normally is playing is they're usually doing an event. It just kinda depends on who owns the parcels, you know, or what events are being held. Wow. So at some parcels there people are like working. People are actually doing jobs and stuff. They're just not like hanging out and exploring. We're kind of exploring. Do you see the cars over there? Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. So people own those. So if you buy an NFT that's a car you own those and you can park it here. Oh. So let's go look at them for a second. So you get a, you actually get like a little parking garage for your car. And if I go up to it, oh. check this out. I can actually open. So if I go to the side and look at the window, point at, uh, wow. let's see. Oh, this one doesn't let you drive it. If you hover over the windshield. Oh, wow. So I, I was driving it for a second. Do you want to take this one? Hit drive and then you're going to have yeah. a third person oh. view. Does it? What does it say for you? Does it let you drive it or no? Uh, I don't know how to engage into the car. All right, hover over the windshield. Like point, point your hand towards the front windshield over here, over here. Like this windshield on the front. Hover your point towards it, and you'll see it says the word drive. No, not the door. The the wind, the front windshield. Let's go back where I'm at. Does it say the word drive for you? Uh -oh. So like when you point, do you have a little line? And then if you hover over this door, does this say pull? Because I can open and close this. Oh, 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 there you go. This is me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The door opens. Well, that's me. Oh. Can you do it? Do you see the word pull? Uh, I don't see the word pull. Mm, I see the word pull and I can open and close and I can see inside the car. I can go in and sit and drive it. That's weird that you don't, when you point your hand, like just put your hand out. And point towards, like, look and point towards the word, the front of this windshield over here. Like, it doesn't look like you're pointing for some reason, but I'm, like, just putting my hand straight ahead. Yeah, like that. So your right hand, okay. just one hand, just one hand. Just, like, point. Like, you're looking at the, it's like you're going to interact with it. You point it, and then it puts a button that says drive. Right, and I'm pointing right at the glass. Do you have a line coming off your finger when you point or no? Yeah. Okay. I see the line. The and blue you, line. When you point at the okay, good. And when you point at the glass in front here, it doesn't say the word drive. Okay, let's go to a different card. Oh, I see. I see it. Go, go. Okay, cool. All right, you're in. So you can drive now. Let me get one. So now we can literally can go explore. Isn't that crazy? This is way different wow. than all the other metaverses. We're literally driving a car. Let's just drive for a few minutes. If I stop, just park next to me, okay? Yeah. So we can talk. Right. I'm gonna take us out of here though, follow me. Jump out, press B. Yeah. Okay. Hey, there we go. I'm gonna stand back up. So we are literally just parked our cars here. And when we come back later, unless somebody else grabs them, they're gonna stay here. That's what's crazy. Like literally it just everything oh, is everything is not like session based. It literally will stay here. And right, somebody right, right. that owns the car can say, Hey, bring the car back and they can reset it. But somebody else can drive this. But we're going to go and look at, like, oh, check wow. out these actual people build these. So, like, this one, do you see all the artwork or is it loading for you? Uh, yeah, I see some artwork here. Do you see, like, a football player and Kobe Bryant with the basketball and you yeah, see yeah, SpaceX? Yeah. Let's go to SpaceX. Yeah. I haven't been over here, but I just yeah. thought we would look at maybe one or two things. Actually, let's go to this Hall of Fame place. This looks pretty cool. It has audio, right? And that's up here. Check this out. So each parcel has its own audio. So we can actually choose. Oh. Like if we own this, we could choose our own audio. You could do a live stream. These can be NFTs on the wall. Or these can just be artwork. 
You can uh, set up chairs and things like that, obviously, like anything architecturally. I mean, this is kind of straightforward. These are just like artwork things. Right, right. But uh, we can go like place to place. So you can be neighbors with the Hall of Fame or you could go. So let's come out this door here. There's 21X, whatever that is. There's like these different environments. The world is ours. This one has lightning coming off of it. You could have lighthouses. Um, depending on how tall your, your space is. So if you have an extra large plot of land, you can go up to XL on the size. Um, if you have a small, then you have a smaller wow. space, but you can only go so tall. So anyway, uh, I know you only have a few minutes left. I was just going to say, let's maybe check out SpaceX really quick, and then we can call it good. This one looks like a, it's an NFT game or something. Whoa. I don't know. And then uh, there's actually links. So I've been into some offices in here before where... Yeah, I've been into some offices before where they have links. So I bet you this one has a link somewhere. Oh, check this out. This is a teleportation spot. So we could go back to anywhere else here. Oh, God. So this particular environment paid for that. Isn't that crazy? Wow. And that's expensive teleportation. Maybe come in here. Let's see if they have a link to their NFT project. Wow, it's audio. Oh, it's this playing behind us. This is a video that you can play and pause. Oh. So theoretically, we could host like we could have our own environments to interview people. Let's come back out here. Uh, I see this is a stage, by the way. Looks like they hold they host events here, and you can be like, hey. So th if you're in the web, technically you could just say, hey, here's what parcel we're at. You can also, if you go to A in your menu and click Map, you can type in the parcel you're looking for, and then you can walk there or take a car there. Did you notice that some avatars actually fly? That's because they paid for jetpacks. Oh really? They're flying. I have. Oh, I can hear you. Ones. Wait, come switch me spots. Check this out. So come stand. This is another cool thing about microphones, kind of similar to Horizon Worlds in that you can come up on the stage and if you're standing in front of the microphone, hey, oh, microphone yeah, yeah, check one. Everyone that's in this particular parcel can hear me. So if I host an event, anybody that's standing at this microphone can hear me. Pretty cool. <laughs> nice, cool. thank you. Anyway. Wow. All right, that was our, what's your first impressions? Maybe we'll capture just a minute here of your thoughts yeah the fidelity is really high like i can see more detail compared to the other worlds it's also like not super cartoony they're still like maintaining i think more we are realistic, but not everyone else like, shape and edge right 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 and and i think the horizon worlds i think was like a little more cartoony like stylized i think but here like i can see more like, more detailed edges yeah. Like of the leaf, like more texture. I yeah. see more. Did you notice that we're in a single server? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like we didn't have any problem finding each other, whereas other worlds, yep. like you have to coordinate like which server, which channel. So they do, I think they do about 100 per server. Or maybe I think they've increased it since. Uh -huh. But they. you can have like, for example, I can say I'm hosting an event here. And so the speaker can be across any an unlimited number of servers so you could have a thousand people here across a oh, hundred servers and including the web and anybody can, like i can host a huge event like maybe it's like a live i'm revealing a new product right and i want to host it in somnium space right, anybody right, right. across any platform across any server can see it so it's like live events are really really well done here in this environment um, we'll have to explore another time but got it pretty cool yeah pretty cool i like it all right, well, I'm going to jump out. Good to see you in the metaverse. All I right. feel like you're almost right here in front of me.